All right, guys. Today we are using Todd Duffy, who of course is set to face Jeff Hughes in a few days. And the last time we saw Todd Duffy in the octagon, he was facing Frank Mir. It was basically a brawl, and he got KO'd in the first round. So, kind of curious to see how he bounces back. Figured he's had more than enough time to rest up, get better, and uh, looking forward to just seeing how the man uh, recoups after that last fight. Now. We're gonna do a showcase and see how we can, uh, how how we fare. The first fight is against uh, Andre Bishop. Always a chore to face Andre Bishop. Thank you. Andre is so fast. I'm not really sure. Right away, I'm getting pressured. And these hands are flowing so freaking fast. Damn, my head is already getting damaged from like a few shots. He's doing a real good job of landing those punches. Oh, and he connects there. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Right away. What in the world? Oh Lord have mercy. Bro, move your head. Oh my god. Wow. 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 Jesus. Beautiful KO for the victory early in the first. God yeah, damn, dude. I got KO'd in the right first round. Jesus. When's the fucking last time that happened? Sometimes when you catch a guy cold oh my God, before dude. he's had a chance to get going in the fight, it can have a bigger effect. Oh my God, so dude. Huge impact here tonight I got KO'd. That knocked out in the first again, round, end. man. And here it is again. Ah, oh, there's no excuse, bro. And he's out. Ah, oh, that stings. All right, let's move on. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment. Our tale of the tape for this. Our main All right, we're facing DC. Oh, man, that last fight, like... differences in height. But big Looking back reach. at it, I used the absolute the worst strategy Ladies ever. Like I, I stood one. I stood too long. I was. I stood on the feet way too long with Andre Bishop. I mean, if I'm using someone like JDS, I mean, I, I'm wary on the feet. I'm extremely technical, and I was. I don't know what the hell I was thinking in that fight. It, it, I mean. It was just the absolute worst strategy I could have used, especially using an extremely low rated character and facing someone with ridiculous speed in the heavyweight division like Andre Bishop. You know, I had to I, I had to slow the fight down. That's what I should have done. Slow the fight down from the get-go. You know. Oh man. Anyways, let's try to fix the mistakes. I'm suspecting that uh, we're going to be grappling in this one. Honestly, I, I would rather face guys like DC, JDS. I mean, they, they'll be faster, way faster than Todd Duffy, but not Andre Bishop fast. You know, not so fast that you can't even react at all to anything being thrown at you. So, here we go. All right, here we go, up for grabs tonight, the title no touch. of baddest man on the planet as we get set to crown a UFC heavyweight champion. All right, so. Good inside leg kick by DC. That was a nice jab. This player is kind of yeah, he's, he's taking up the posture of someone kick. who wants to strike. Oh, and he lands yeah, he's clearly kick. kickboxing. The left hook hits home. Big punches. Hard uppercut to the head. You see that? Yeah, that's the posture of a striker. He throws. He got me. Oh, Jesus. Again. We need to, we need to, we need to buckle up, man. We, we, we got to tighten things up. I mean, I, I get that I'm using a low rated character, but it should not be this easy. To get ahead on me. A little bit of blood coming out of his left side of his forehead. Need to pressure this man. Oh, he got caught again by another hook there. He's been connected with a few so far here in this round. 
There we go, set him down. Stack guard. He's got him stacked here. He's got to be careful as he has him stacked here, though. He doesn't get trapped into a triangle. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Oh, he can just posture up right there. And busy as he that was, to that was here. quick. No chance of denying this that. Shot, got it. Got it. There you go. Good shot to the body. Vicious, vicious punch combinations here. Excellent punch. Okay, I wasn't uh, fast enough on that clutch. one. I want the double nice underhooks the and see if we can dump them right here. Duffy gets no, sir. Here in the Where do you now think to you're going? Go back oh, on your back. There we go. 90 seconds now remain in the round. Mm -mm. He's Got working it. from half guard now. Opponent pressed up against the cage. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. And he's in full guard. I should be able to just posture up right here. One minute to go here in the opening round. No, sir. There we go. He moves to stacking him now. Oh, we caught him with that right hand. Excellent movement on the ground here. Oh, he's out. To better his position. Cormier gets up, but he looks dazed. He looks confused. I think the long arms is going to well, cause issues for him. Tonight, I just don't want to. We'll there we go. Uh huh. I saw that one coming from a mile away. Final seconds of round one. See, I don't want to be in here. I don't want to be in the pocket with any of these guys. Because in the pocket is where the speed is amplified. But from a distance, I feel like I can lunge in with a jab straight. And if at the same, because that's the way we got him in the first round. Right there, boom, boom. See, caught him. We caught him with the with the straight before his own straight it was anywhere near landing and that that resulted in the in the drop so we'll see if we can use the same tactic again in this round that last round was that jab straight should be money there you go there you go he's stumbling oh he might be out yeah he's probably gonna start sliding or slipping to the side these guys are yeah that jab straight is money bro He's ducking it now. So the uppercut's gonna come. Oh, blocks the shot. Beautiful jab. There's the uppercut right there. There's the uppercut. Hook shot, Joe, and he paid for it. He is leaning in. I know he's got the guard high, but that means the body is exposed, and the opposition took full advantage there. Let me guess. He's gonna lunge him with oh, something nice big. Probably that front that kick. Hurt. It appears that cut is getting worse. Well, the offense has been there. Yeah, yeah that's his shot. Shots, but not oh, got, got him. That's the uppercut. I guarantee he was Trying ducking down right there. Oh, nice punch there by Duffy. Slightly deflected. Sorry about that. He landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely pick up. He is in trouble. Got him again. Oh, that does it. Unbelievable. That does it. Phone ringing almost ruined everything. But man, we, we made some pretty good adjustments in that round right there. See that one more time. Boom. Damn, that right hook actually caught him as he was leaning back. One more time. Boom. Clipped him, sit him down, and the fight is over. Here we see it again. All right, people. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, I'll be right back. So on the sports biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Fabricio Verdun. It's been a while since I saw Fabricio. I don't even think, I can't remember the last time I used him in this game. He was a way more popular in, uh, in UFC 2. It was him and it was John Jones, I believe, in UFC 2. In UFC 3, it's Andre Bishop. It's Daniel Cole, it's you know it's DC, it's uh, Junior Dos Santos, 
but it's mostly Andre Bishop. Like if you if you play in the heavyweight division ex exclusively, you're gonna run into a lot of Bishop players. And we are underway. Thank you, sir. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Now, I wonder if I can. Yeah, I don't think I can use the straight against this guy because we're about the same height. So. I'm gonna just keep things as clean as I possibly can. Good overhand. Call me with that one. He caught the kick. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really yeah. starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to Let's do some counter striking. Pretty good knee to the body by Verdun. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Oh, oh beautiful, beautiful there. Nasty combination. Wow. Got him. Oh. He's got him hurt here. He loves that combo. It's a good combo. Beautiful body shot. shot there too. the shot here Joe how about that shit? lunging in with huge strikes let me guess lead head kick he's fainting with the punch that was close lead head kick into the straight that's your favorite to lunge in with oh another one to the head by Duff no that's the overhand this time there you go there's the combo so no damage inflicted there Nice nope. defense on the single leg takedown. You can tell he's worked on that. Stay on top a little bit. Mm -mm. Oh, wow. He's doing a great job. Dude, I saw that transition. coming and I denied it, but. Okay. Fighters back to their feet here. Excellent movement here on the ground. Now he's got over under. No, sir. No, sir. And the fighters now separate as the action continues. I don't understand these escapes when he's I deny them. It just it makes no sense. But I'll take it. Verdum gets caught with that punch. Better question is, well why in the hell would I want to be in the clinch with Verdum, right? <laughs> oh, straight punch. See, now that he's throwing the the knee, you're going to see me switch to the straight into the lead uppercut. Got him. Nope, no, I know. I get it. We're not going to get overzealous on anything at all. See, right there is the straight lead uppercut does it. Well, they made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg straight. There's the lead uppercut. See, it, it's landing. It's landing kind of clean. Let's see if we can explore that a little bit more in the second round. That was a good first. I think I won that, definitely. Let's keep it going just like that. If you guys are enjoying the video so far, do not forget to leave a like. Here we go with round two. You guys always do, and I really appreciate that. was clearly hurt. He's going to look to start this round off. There you go. There's my shot. Uh-huh. It's over. There we go. You guys, you know, try to try to remember some of the things that I that I show you. Like that straight into the lead uppercut. The second you're fighting someone that's throwing knees and elbows, one, two, boom. The second you're facing someone that's throwing a lot of knees and elbows, remember that combo. Boom. That one did it. Sit him down. Well, not sit him down. We knelt him down. Face plant him. Hammer fists. And the fight is over. All right. Let's do one more fight. One more. And we'll call it a day. Be right well, back. Moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Now our tail of the tape for this. Ladies and gentlemen, we have come so full circle. This is the same guy that knocked me out in the first round at the start of this video. It's time to get my revenge. I will have my revenge. <laughs> what will you do, father? You can no longer hide behind the skirts of Athena. Oh, man. 
Let me know if you guys get got that reference in the comments section. Petulance, child! I will tolerate your insolence no more! Let's go! Let's go! I am eager. I'm gonna show you guys how to beat this man. Show you guys the right strategy. And we are underway. Thank you. Oh my Jesus. No, come here. Excuse me. We're not doing that this time. Freaking hell. Into side control again. No, sir. Oh, my God. We're probably not going to do much from here. He's good. Half guard might be the. Alright, let's try to posture up from half guard. He postures into place. Bishop getting worked to the body now by that elbow. So no, nice sir. Where do you think you're there. going? Oh, and again uh -uh. with the big elbow, Joe. That hurts to watch. No, 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 sir. If you don't mind, I'm gonna ground you for as long as I possibly can. The Slow down this fight, bro. Uh-huh. Uh-uh. 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 You're gonna have to do something else, bro. Good left hand. Getting beat up. Alright. Oh, thank you very much, bro. He's gotta be careful as he has him stacked here, though. He doesn't get trapped into a triangle. He got it. Wow. Oh, he gets reversed. Oh, wait a minute. Back up. Was that a momentum transition? Good defense there. Nice punch by Bishop. Oh, hell no. I think it was. Hold Duffy on. Gets in the clinch yet again. Nah. You know, I'm going to do it again, right? Come here. Come here, bro. Well, Joe, I know he's an offensive Come on. fighter, but he's going to have to figure Come some on. things out here to Come on. Moving forward and I will be grabbing you very shortly. No. Gets in the clinch again. This no. Has historically been a good position for him. Let's see how and you're going for a right. That is a momentum transition. No, sir. I'm also trying to have fun with this and not be and not be too serious. Now he's stacking him. Bishop gets back up again. Switching stances here. Of course, I'm being serious. Like I'm, I'm being serious. With my strategy, which is, we're gonna box on my own terms, on my own terms. So he's really starting to put together and some significant while he's throwing, keep the block high. You keep the block, high. Keep the block high. Exactly. You don't give him too much. And if you're gonna throw, keep it very short. Right there, he's rocked. He's in trouble. He's in trouble. Oh, he might be out. If you're gonna throw, keep it very short and avoid. All exchanges. Avoid all exchanges. When I say exchanges, I'm talking about moments where you're throwing as you see him throwing. Don't do that. If he's throwing shots, block. And then if he's blocking, try to throw. But don't throw on throw. Don't throw as he throws. That's that's when you get into a situation where the speed kills you. Thank you, sir. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in Got this em. round, someone's getting knocked out. And right away, I, I think ground. I won that first round. This round will be no different. No, sir. Side control now. There's that knee to the body. He's doing a good job with his defense from side control, though. I tell you that much. Which tells me the man knows how to grapple, at least. Definitely does. Pretty good knee to the body by Dunn. Well, nice you know, knee and again. he does. He's not just sitting there. He's actually faking. See that? Huge a big elbow elbow there. To the head. He's probably going to gas him out, though. He gets the full mount. He's trying to arm trap. All right, let's posture down a little bit. No, sir. No, sir. 
Let's posture up here. Let's work. And we'll posture down again. Work. And we'll just keep combining both. Try to see if we can overload his brain until he does something different. Because right now he's just trying to arm trap me. Posture. Work, work, work. There you go. There you go. Bishop's got a bruise starting to appear on that right side of his body now. Right side of his body? That's his left side, That's bro. What are you right talking there. about? Elbow attack to the body now. No. Under two minutes here to go in round two. Some good punches from the top here. Getting blasted. He's getting blasted. Well, the ground and pound is there once again. Strong work here by Duffy. He's good. He's back in the full guard now. Posture up right away. Gets the stack the guard. Now. Oh, effective strike there by Duffy. All Bishop right. Gets up. He is back once up again. Here. Got him. Clinch now. Bishop gets the tie clinch here. Come here. This is a very good spot for him, Joe. Damn, I'm denying these. And now he's got the tie clinch. Oh, a huge block there. <laughs> he's got to avoid the clinch. Wow. There you go. And just like that, just like that, this fight is easy. Just like that. It's all... Switch your strategy, man. Use the right strategy. And even ridiculously difficult matchups like this, you can make things, you can make your life easy. I just, I don't know what the hell I was thinking in that first fight. I have no idea what I was thinking. I mean, I played that one like a complete bomb, to be completely honest with you guys. And it, it happens to me like that sometimes. Sometimes I just... <laughs> All right. Thank you, sir. Doing a good job, though. Got him. Sit him down. Um. See, right, right now we're beating him everywhere. On the ground, on the feet. Okay, good job. Doing a pretty damn good job of these traps. Not letting me do anything. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Posture up. No. 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 Where do you think oh, you that is rough. are going? Big body, body shot. shot there, too. I wonder if he's gassed by now. We've blasted that body quite a few times, dropped him a few times, rocked him a few times. We've been sitting on him also quite a bit. Good shot to the body. Oh, elbow up top by Bishop. I think he's fairly hip to my strategy right now of posturing up, so. Let's go. There we go. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Well, you got to admire the He's gassed. here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it. Lighten up his opponent left and right. Oh! He's still dangerous, though. Just because we've rocked him a few times and because he's gassed doesn't mean that we get to just get reckless. That's another mistake some you know players make. Don't make that mistake. Keep your head the whole time. Punch coming, it's blocked. Trust me, he's not as vulnerable as you think. He can well, still he knock your head off your shoulders. Yet, so we're keeping the same tactic. I only strike when fight. he's but not striking. There will be no exchanging going on bit. here. With his see right there, I try to exchange, see what happens? Don't do that. Got him. It's over. There we go. And that's gonna do it. And that does it ladies and gentlemen if you guys enjoyed the video please do not forget to leave a like let me know what your thoughts are on the uh on the on the fights which one was your favorite 
Let me know. Let me know. Um, I'm probably going to do Glover to Shara tomorrow. It's either going to be Glover or uh, Cowboy. I don't know yet. But I do know that I'm going to visit all these characters. Glover, Cowboy, Cerrone, Justin Gaethje. I'm going to use all of them before the actual card. So um, watch out for that. But that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support. Really, really appreciate it. And uh, I'll see you guys later. As always, stay safe. Have a wonderful day. So there he is, the man of the moment. Certainly maximized the showcase here tonight, Joey. Gets a big win by way of the knockout. Certainly kept the judges out of it here tonight. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there will be no wiping the smile off of his face tonight. He will party deep into the night with his friends, his family. A huge knockout turned in by that man here tonight. And he has set himself up for a huge fight now, moving forward inside the octagon.